we'll see now for consonant for consonant the same way like how we used to keep all the uh, vowels together here we'll uh, used to take the consonant letter alphabet together so in this word temple what are the consonant alphabet tmpl so you have to keep tmpl separate so what are the left out word only e and t so when you take the arrangement you can arrange tmpl in this place or this place or this place so that will be a three different placements three factorial then this is itself of four letter consonants so it will be four factorial divided by the repeated word that is two factorial you remember that whether it is vowel consonant or any kind of question if you find the repetition in the word you have to always divide the number of letter factorial divided so it is what is the value now this value is 72 okay then we'll see a different type that is never together what is happening in never together never together is in the sense total number of ways divided by always together so the way you can arrange the word completely minus the word which you can keep always together okay so we'll see you have to understand it very clearly that learn is a vowel word okay so how can you arrange them where they the vowel should never be together so to know never be together you can easily know that um, always together and subtract it from the total number of ways right so uh, we did both total number of ways also and um, we have done always together always together for learn we have got 4 into 2 factorial and total number of ways we have not done but i told you that if repetition is not there total alphabet factorial you can take it means if learn is there for learn like total number of ways will be totally 5 are there so it will be 5 factorial first total number of ways minus always together always together in the sense how many alphabet are there two alphabet so you can keep it in one two three four places so four and itself two so five factorial minus four factorial into two factorial so what will be the value we can easily calculate using the calculator that one so first is what is five factorial that you can calculate on your own also that is 120 minus 4 factorial into 2 factorial so that will be like here it is not coming 4 4 factorial into 2 factorial so what is the answer for it 48 and 5 factorial is 120 so 120 minus 48 you can easily do it so what is the answer for it 72 so our answer is now 72 clear so the same way we'll see here in the word sister what are the vowels you have got two and total is six right one two three four five six so six factorial then um Again in sister repetition is there s is present twice so 6 factorial divided by 2 factorial why I am dividing because we have seen that wherever repetition is there we used to divide so the same way for sister we are dividing here minus um, always together so always together means this two will be together so if you write sister except the vowels what you can write. You can write like this so how many places 1 2 3 4 5 total 5 places into again this 2 together 2 factorial divided by again repetition is there so 2 factorial so we can calculate it using the calculator that is 6 factorial divided by 2 how much it is 360 minus 5 factorial see 5 factorial into 2 factorial divided by 2 factorial so it means you are cancelling out 2 so 5 factorial is 120 okay so 
this is cancel out so this is 120 so how much you are getting 240 is the answer